Mmm, I'm not sure how we're gonna get out of this one. But yeah, all I'm gonna do is guard with these two characters for the next round. Hmm. Master? Keep your wits about you. He's distorting his own image. It's no wonder that the moves have no effect. Ah, that's why we can't hit him. Okay. That makes sense. And for this part, you just want to keep your HP up. There's nothing you can do, you can't hurt this thing. Just like before. Again. <laughs> well, here we go. Now we can actually hurt him. So I'm going to use Sky Fang for starters. And it doesn't matter what I use after that. Fist of Glory. And whatever that works. You have for it. I think this guy has about 16,000 HP. Has that? Got a third of it gone. That was easy. Gross guts? Yeah, okay. Thanks. Thanks for the gross guts. Some of these collectibles just don't make any sense to me. Yeah, Maya saved us with her power. Hey, hey, she can talk. How about that, huh? She's no longer a mute.
Oh uh, yeah, you did, but it helped us out. Absolutely, man. You should learn how to use this, this power. I love the theme playing here. I like the music in this game. It's pretty good. Well, maybe you should learn. Let's go back to camp, because, um, well, I want to show off some camp chat, I guess, now that Maya can actually talk. Hmm. That's right. Oh, you're welcome. Yeah, yeah, it was a little bit wild. There you go. That's what you need, a little confidence. I think we're all set and ready to go. So let's get the hell out of here. Let's make our way up to the castle. Oh, there's more of this? Oh, okay. Well, I guess we're not going to be going to the castle yet. We still have more of the Cabell ruins to explore. Obscure writings, huh? Camping kit, that's pretty good. Ancient writing, what in the world is an ancient writing? Oh, it's a collectible. Alright. Hmm. Zone state zone stay aura? Hyperdimensional predator? Oh, okay. Weird shit I'm talking about in this place. Oh god. The image of a tortoise is engraved here. Yeah, this is one of those uh, puzzles that I was probably stuck on forever. Uh, yeah, this first area right here, a couple skeletons ambush you, and uh, another skeleton's gonna ambush me. Yay! I'll just show this. Fuck it. Go 
hopefully this guy just attacks, doesn't use something annoying like hate force. Oh come on. You suck, dude. Branded curse, okay, that's not as bad. Because it's not gonna matter anyways. Because Kazan's probably gonna attack first as it is. Get better as I get older. Yeah. Older and wiser. The skeletons are annoying. But that's alright. Alright. Hope this hopefully this is worth it. There is an order to everything. Oh god. Okay, so that's not the right order. That's one of them. So we're supposed to find the correct order of lighting these razors. And it looks like I found it. We get Adventurer's Log 2. Oh, yay. What manner of garbage is this going to tell me? I don't think I even read the first one. Hung the plaque of a fish. Yeah, okay. We already, I already knew that one, though. That one was easy. We were trapped in a room in which hung a plaque of a tortoise. I was put off by the pedestals there. Too colorful for the Cabell ruins. Yellow earth bathed in indigo waters, and the world was cleansed. Red sun bore green winds, and the world was healed. Yeah, and, and supposedly you're supposed to figure out the order of the colors by that little riddle there, which, uh, I don't know, it's still confusing to me. So yeah, I gotta read that shit again. Yellow earth bathed in indigo waters. Yellow, indigo, red, green? Yellow, indigo, red, green. Maybe. Which one is indigo? I don't even know what the color indigo is. Oh, okay. And then this one's red. And this one? Holy shit, I got a first try. Wow. I didn't even look that one up either. <laughs> oh man, more of those guys. Come on. Hmm. What in the world is over here? Something I can't mess around with right now, so I guess I'll just have to skip it. Alright, what the hell is in here? The clock shows 3 o'clock. Hmm. So, we'll do this. Right? That one's pretty easy. Okay. Obviously I need to backtrack. Cause I never got what's in, what was in here. We got Adventures Log 3, which, uh... I don't know what it's gonna say. Seven to the right, four to the left, two to the right, and fifteen to the... Oh, God. Yeah, okay. I think I know which one they're talking about. We'll come back to that. That 
gate is locked. On the thunder switch that he can't use yet. Come on, man. Oh, what the frick? How the hell am I supposed to get across here? Am I missing something? Unless there is something over here that we can... What the frick? I'm confused. I'm lost. What the fuck? I don't get it. What the fuck, man? Don't get it. Oh. I never went in here, did I? Oops. <laughs> well, that answers my question. Okay, so what did that freaking logbook say? Seven to the right, four to the left. Two to the right, and then fifteen to the left. Seven to the right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then what do they say? Four to the left? One, two, three, four. Right? Is that what it said? Two to the right and then fifteen to the left. Okay. So this one? It's two to the right and then fifteen to the left. So one, two, three. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Hey, there we go. That wasn't so bad. Plague cure. Let me get a golden key. Which I imagine will unlock that iron gate. Oh, come on! Anyways... Yeah, that was bullcrap. Yes, I would! I would like to use the gold key. Are we finally at the castle? Yes, we are, and I'm going to save exploring the castle again for the next episode. This has been Veto121. I'd like to thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time.